So this is just a short one for you all today. Each person living in Althea has what is known as a count. This is effectively their life force. To find out more about the counts, you can check out my video going over them in a bit more detail. Now, once this count hits zero, they get sent to the abyss. But what is this mysterious place? Let's find out. But before we do, for more weekly anime character facts videos, make sure to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss a video. And a quick warning that there will be spoilers in this video, so just a heads up. Anyway, with that being said, let's roll intro and get straight into the video. The Abyss was first mentioned to us in episode 1 of the anime and chapter 1 of the Plunderer manga, so it has been brought to our attention very early on so that we know it is something that we should perhaps fear. And fear it we should, as the Abyss has been the reference to a person's death in this world, but it actually isn't death. In fact, death would be a much better outcome rather than being dragged into this Abyss. The Abyss is a place where its suffering is worse than death, as the Abyss is actually a ruined Japanese country that was all caused by the abandonment war that happened 300 years prior to the events of the first episode of the anime. Though the Abyss lacks in resources, it does have a small population living and residing there, and is almost the opposite of Althea in terms of its fantasy setting, as there is some modern technology there, including airplanes, and most shockingly, nuclear weapons. Now, there isn't really any information about why the suffering down there is a fate worse than death, but we do have some very interesting information about its rule, which does contain a major spoiler, so if you don't want to be hit by that spoiler, then tune out here, and if you do, thanks for watching to this point up until now. Now, the rule of the Abyss is its king, Sakai Tokikaze, who is one of the seven legendary Red Barons, known as the Blink Baron, the adoptive brother of Licht, and Hina's father. I won't go into much more detail about this man as I plan to make a full fact video on him at a later date, but to give you an idea on why this man should be feared is because of his counts of 507,025. This count stands for how many loved ones this man has killed. But thanks for watching my video explaining the abyss from the series Plunderer. I hope you enjoyed the video and if you'd like to see more videos from this series, let me know in the comments. And a quick shout out to Warwick for supporting me on Patreon, as well as the beautiful bunch displayed on the screen, and of course, the rest of you supporting me on the other tiers. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for supporting me. If you're interested in what rewards I have to offer on my Patreon, the link is in the description. Don't forget to smash the like button if you enjoyed this video, check out my other links in the video description, and then of course, subscribe for more anime content. Till next time, my fellow weebs, peace!